Hello folks, Pushma here. Apple has recently introduced a series of AI-driven enhancements for Safari, aimed at making the browsing experience more intelligent and natural. There is a lot to explore, so let's dive into the detail, starting with a flagship feature intelligent search. This tool allows Safari to automatically summarize web content using advanced AI, eliminating the need to shift through lengthy articles. Intelligent search identifies the essential topics, phrases, and ideas, and crafts a concise summary to quickly convey the gist of information. Before moving further, if you are also interested in learning AI tools, then we have an amazing workshop with us in just rupees 9. Link is in description. 9 rupees. 9 rupees cannot even buy you this packet of biscuit. But what if I tell you that 9 rupees can help you save your job? What if I tell you that 9 rupees can 3x your salary? Yes, this is possible because I am going to conduct a workshop at just rupees 9 on ChatGPT and other AI tools which is highly recommended for all working professionals out there. Now, let's get back to our tutorial. From what we understand, this feature utilizes Apple's cutting-edge on-device AI models, particularly the AJAX language learning model. This AI analyzes the text to extract significant sentences, repetitive keywords, and structural elements, determining the core topics and distilling them into a perfectly tailored summary. Another exciting addition to Safari 18 is the Web Eraser tool. As the name suggests, this feature allows users to erase or remove unwanted parts of a web page with just a few taps. Whether it's a banner ad or any distracting images, Web Eraser can handle it swiftly. More impressively, an eraser is persistent. If you close a tab or a window and later revisit the page, Safari will reload it with your custom modification in place. It will remember the parts you removed and keep them erased. Safari will also notify you when a page has altered based on your preference, offering a chance to revert if desired. While the concept may draw inspiration from third-party ad blockers and content filtering extensions, integrating this directly into Safari is a significant innovation. Before moving further, update, you all know that AI is taking over the world in such a short span of time. We have seen so many layoffs, millions of jobs replaced by AI and whatnot. You don't want to get affected by this recession wave, right? Well, AI won't replace you, but the person using AI will. And if you want to save your job and become irreplaceable in your career, Join our 3 hours AI tool workshop in which we'll teach you about how to upscale, increase your productivity and enhance your career. Now, in this update, Apple is also overhauling the user's interface by consolidating many page controls and options that were previously scattered across different menus into a single centralized menu located in the address bar. This menu that zone settings, content blockers and extension shortcuts are now just a click or tap away. Simplifying the interface and enhancing the user's experience, this consolidation represents a small but impactful quality of life improvement that streamlines workflow and enhances browsing smoothness. Alongside these features, we can expect the usual refinements and under-the-hood upgrades with Safari 80, including more robust content blocking and UI enhancements. However, the integration of AI features is a highlight, marking Apple's significant commitment to leveraging artificial intelligence to reshape our interaction with digital content. Privacy concerns are always paramount, especially with such advancement technologies, Apple assures that AI operations for features like intelligent search are processed entirely on device, ensuring that personal data remains secure and never leaves the user's device. This approach reinforces Apple's long-standing commitment to privacy and security, maintaining users' trust even as they adopt advanced AI capabilities. While not every feature explored during development may reach the final product and some may be delayed or scaled back. It's clear that Apple is fully embracing AI to lead the revolution in intelligent user experience. This enhancement in Safari are just one part of larger AI strategy. Rumors also suggest that Apple is developing an advanced visual search tool that could revolutionize how we obtain information about real-world objects, products, and more. By simply using the camera to analyze photos and images, this visual search technology is still in our early stages compared to the Safari AI features raising questions about how it will integrate with apps or services and whether it will operate at a system level or be app-specific. 
Apple remains quite reserved about these specifics, but the potential is enormous, suggesting a feature where our device not only understands but anticipates our needs, offering a seamless ambient AI experience that integrates automatic summarization and data extraction. As we approach Apple's annual worldwide development event where they will unveil their latest software updates and innovations, the anticipation builds. There might be surprises yet unseen, but the leaked features of Safari 18 suggest a transformative shift in how we browse the web and interact with information. The integration of AI into browsing could lead to a new era of intelligent distraction free browsing and content consumption. Responsible AI development remains a honest issue, with significant concerns around privacy, ethics, transparency and potential negative impacts that need careful navigation despite well-deserved skepticism and uncertainty about how the AI revolution could affect society. It's clear that major tech companies like Apple are betting big on artificial intelligence to reshape the future of consumer technology from mobile and desktop to wearable experience as AI assistants become increasingly capable of understanding and streamlining our digital lives. It's not hard to imagine a future where such technologies are the norms. Be sure to subscribe for more updates and thanks for tuning in. This was Ushma signing off until next time.